Hey there, history buffs. Today, let's dive into the chaotic days in Berlin right after Hitler's death. It's May 1945. Picture the scene. The Third Reich has crumbled and Berlin is in ruins. So, what happened on the streets of Berlin after Hitler died? Well, first off, the news spread like wildfire. As soon as people heard about Hitler's suicide in his bunker on April 30th, the city was thrown into turmoil. Imagine the confusion. The symbol of Nazi Germany was gone, and nobody knew what was coming next. With Hitler gone, Joseph Goebbels, his propaganda minister, briefly took the reins. But his leadership was short-lived. He and his wife committed suicide on May 1st, after poisoning their six children. Just a day later, Grand Admiral Karl Donitz took over, but he couldn't do much to stop the inevitable. The streets of Berlin were a mix of fear, chaos, and desperate hope. People huddled in basements and makeshift shelters trying to survive the relentless bombings. Soviet troops were closing in, and soon they entered the city, igniting fierce urban warfare. The sounds of gunfire, explosions, and cries filled the air. Civilians faced unimaginable horrors. Many were caught in crossfires, while others were subjected to violence and atrocities by the invading forces. But amid the chaos, there were also tales of resilience and small acts of kindness. Neighbors helped each other find food and water, and some Soviet soldiers showed compassion towards the civilians. By May 2nd, Berlin had officially fallen to the Soviets. The red flag was raised over the Reichstag, signaling the end of Nazi control. The city was left in a state of devastation, buildings reduced to rubble, infrastructure destroyed, and a population grappling with the aftermath of war. In the months that followed, Berlin was divided into sectors controlled by the Allies, the Soviets, Americans, British, and French. Each sector had its own challenges and recovery processes, leading to the eventual divide between East and West Berlin. But that's a story for another day. So, there you have it. A snapshot of what Berlin was like right after Hitler's death. A city in chaos, but also a city that would rise from the ashes. History is full of these powerful moments and they remind us of the resilience of the human spirit. Thanks for tuning in, and if you enjoyed this peek into post-war Berlin, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.